So this question is really about the taking any general parabola equation and writing it in the intercept form. And essentially, in other words, we have to kind of complete the square here. It's really uh, the equivalent. Um, there are several different ways to do You can either go and rewrite this in that form. And I'm going to factor out the 8. And then I'm going to complete that square. So this is going to be x plus half square because when you multiply the cross terms, you're going to get twice the product of these, which will be x. Now I got to subtract half square because when I square that, I'll have this additional term and I need to get back to that. So that becomes 8 times x plus half square. I'm going to multiply 8 with this. This is minus 1 fourth. So 8 times minus 1 fourth is minus 2, minus 6. So my factored form is this. Now I have to compare it to this guy. And you will see h, if you compare those two, h is minus half and k is minus 8. If I look at the answer choices, that's choice A. This is one way to do it. The other way is to recognize that in this form, and this is, you do need to know this, is that hk are the vertex of this parabola. How do we find the x-coordinate of the vertex? It's minus b over 2a for a general parabola. This is the axis of symmetry. So that would be minus b, a is 8, and then 2 times 8, that's minus half, which means h is minus half. And that alone would give you the answer directly because only one answer choice has that. To find k, you would take minus half, which is really the y coordinate of the vertex. You replace x with minus half. Again, everything I'm doing here, you need to know and understand where it's coming from. So this is... 2 minus 10, which is minus 8. I do indeed get the value that I had earlier. So the answer again is choice A.